What's up, YouTube? I'm back with another episode of Chuck's Hobby Spot. So, well, this video, I want to do a shop update and let you guys know where I am with uh, the Morgan three-wheeler. So, I've got some cool stuff done to it. I'm basically in the prep stages, but there's some stuff you should know before you start doing it to... Uh, to make it go together, I mean, not to really to make it go together, just in the prep of this thing, how to straighten parts, uh, your typical stuff. So, um, and when you comment, uh, I try to answer every comment. And if I don't, just kind of be patient with me because sometimes I don't see it or sometimes it just doesn't come right in on the, on the YouTube feed. So if I'm late on it, I try to comment on everything. So uh, even to you, Karen, <laughs> you know who you are. So, uh, it, first of all, uh, another thing I want to explain is I review stuff doesn't mean I'm part of the business. I do, I do Joel a favor and in return, he does, he, he does hook me up on parts and stuff sometimes, but this isn't the complaint line. This is my YouTube channel. If you have any sort of complaint with any product I put on here, email that person. And if they don't, I mean, I personally know this This certain person was replied to. I did see it all. So Joel has a very, very good uh, customer service. So it, all of his people over there are excellent. So... Uh, one of the people on here wanted me do, to do a review on, on customer service that he does. And I, heck, I will. Every time I order something, I get a confirmation and a tracking right away. Excellent service. <laughs> so so uh, every once in a while, you have that one person that uh, I'll just, I won't even name names. I'll, we'll just call her Karen. But uh, that will complain about stuff. So, I mean but it was sent out right away. A certain person isn't answering their emails or looking in their spam folder or something. So anyway, I don't want to make this a complaint answering line or nothing like that, but let's remember, I'm just doing a review of what I think of a product. And if I think it's spot on, it's spot on. The customer service spot on, it's spot on. So, but anyway, enough of that. So, uh, if you guys are wondering what this is about, look at the last couple of vids I did and look in the comments. You can see who it is. So anyway, uh, let's check out this. Let's check out this three wheeler. So I'm going to turn the camera around. Okay, guys. All right, here we go. All right, guys, here we are. So I have got everything sanded down and I'll get some light on here. Everything was sanded down. I did do the body. Took a little bit of work, but not much. Uh, the main part of this was right in here, which it's a nice, big, wide, flat spot. So it's really not that hard to do. So the whole thing is all prepped, ready to go. I even did the bottom. So I I, I went and prepped the bottom. So when, when you pick my my vehicle up you can turn it over and it'll be prepped too so i did some research on these and this seems like it's the new style morgan from like the you know 15 ish because I, I did some watch some vids and did some research which means that this this engine in here would be like a an sns style motorcycle like a like a harley reproduction type of type of motor here so these uh, fenders now on here were bowed completely out. So I made sure, and on the real one, they are bowed a little bit, but I took it and I straightened it under hot water. I, I took and ran one sink with hot water and the other side of the sink in the bedroom, the bedroom bathroom with hot water because I got two sink or cold water because I got two sinks. So I bent it in, I put it under hot water, and then I went directly to the cold side and, and cooled it down right away and it bent it right in, in place. You can see that it's not coming out to here anymore. And this stuff, be easy with the 
holding again under there because it'll it'll move really easy so this stuff is really easy to work with and uh it, it does straighten real easy so i've got all the wheels prepped getting ready to paint some flat black on there all of them are prepped all the wheels are prepped and you can see after primer i mean they, they look great you know no mo no lines on them same with this i really didn't have to do a lot especially to this side but i mean look look how clean that is so i mean once it's painted and stuff i mean the interior it's pretty clean i've been watching some vids on these <laughs> there's a guy that does a vid on it and he, he's talking about why it's the worst and the best vehicle of all time <laughs> It's pretty good. So if you see that on there, I forget the name of it. It it, it it's pretty good. <laughs> I think this would be cool to just to put around on one of these. I mean, I'm into motorcycles, so this is my forte per se. So you, I just want to show you how clean everything comes out after it's in primer, and you do a little bit of work to it. Most of the stuff you really didn't have to do any work to it. So. I actually want to build another one and, and just go totally custom crazy on it. So, But uh, this one here, I kind of promised I'd try to stay as uh, box stock as possible on it. So just so that the customer can see what this is all about. So, And check this out. This is the front nose piece. Look how nice this comes on in here. Perfect that lines up in there. I mean, that's beautiful. Didn't take any work. Pedals are all done. And all the little stuff back there, I mean, it's it's pretty much, that, that's that's what it is. That's where I'm at. now. From now, it should be pretty easy to get this thing up and going. So I'm sorry, guys, for the rant, but I, it, we, we got to keep this as a, an information channel, a, a kind of reaching out to people channel. You know, this is how I meet my friends and how we communicate with each other. And this is what I, I like to have community fun. It's not, it's not a Revell complaint center or a Iceman complaint center or AMT complaint center. It's, there's places for that. It's not on my channel. It, it I enjoy the product and I'm bringing it to you guys. It, it, but, uh, nothing but great stuff i've seen so and i haven't really heard anybody complain about delivery time i mean that's just crazy talk i mean i order something it's there in two or three days so but anyway so i hope you guys um enjoy what i put down here sorry for the rant and and uh see you in the next vid guys next vid should be positive so take care and have a great week. Why do you watch this crap? <laughs> Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, hit that bell. And uh, talk at you guys later.